first i will choose this image which is orange wedge and i will use this picture rotate it okay like this in a straight way okay and i will duplicate the page okay and in the first page i will use edit scroll down to find duotone go to custom and change both the colors to black okay so this one is done now i will go to elements again and the second picture which i will be using is this one which is goldfish looking for way out so i will use this picture and i will just decrease the transparency here and make the size bigger and paste it accordingly okay make it slightly lower like this because we want to keep the water intact so i will use this water part and slightly make it down so that i can make the water pop up also like this okay so the water part is here visible now increase the transparency cut the picture by using control plus x in the keyboard and add page here and paste it by using control plus v in the keyboard okay so please download the page 1 and 3 by clicking on share click on download make sure it is in png and just download the page 1 and 3 so page 1 is downloaded now i will download the page 3 so page 3 is also downloaded now i will scroll down to find apps and add page to reupload both the images which i just downloaded which is of the fish and the orange which is in duotone black color so i will now click on blend here click on blend image app for the bottom layer use this orange and for the upper layer use this fish upper layer or the top layer so as you can see the image is created now use the second page and add to design here okay so the design is added now let's make it to the same size and after that just use bg remover so this one is done now i will just crop out and right click it go to layer send to back and as you can see i can find this orange layer click on bg remover now double click it to activate the background remover brush here and just delete the parts which i not require so i will click on erase here use a small brush and take your time to erase the parts so the erasing part is done now click on this cross icon here and the erasing is done now this part is activated as you can see in here but there is a problem that the fish here which is available in this image is not coming here so what to do i have to add the fish but how to do i will add this image here copy it paste it and just copy it
and click on BG remover to remove the background. Okay, so the background is removed. Now just use this part till here. Okay, don't use more than that and just crop out these parts also because we don't require that and just zoom in to see if the image is blending fine or not. So the image is absolutely blending fine. So this one is done. But another thing which I want to make you know that this part is ready. So I can just uh, group them and use it for any of my design. But another thing I want to show it to you which you can't do if you just don't learn how to do the next process which is just make it uh, slightly smaller and just keep it in 18 degrees and ungroup it. So to show this part I will bring on uh, orange which is completely here. So this one is the image which is ripe orange and I will add this but as you can see when I am adding this here and clicking on send to back it is directly going to back but it is not creating a transparent layer which you can do easily by just clicking here click on layers go to show layers and you can find this image and just duplicate this image by clicking on here and then duplicate. Okay, so just keep it till here. And after that, just decrease the transparency. Okay, decrease it till 55 and to check. And for this now, let's move it below and this one just up to it okay so now as you can see the transparent layer is created and you can make the same and now if you move the orange up or down you can see it is working fine okay so I will make the both the orange in the same layer in same scale. So let's see if you can do it or not. So this one is done same layer. So now we will add some shadow here. So for that I will click on shadow here. And select the first one. Place it right here. Slightly up because we will put the next shadow here so select it and duplicate it and place it right here okay and now again go to layers and now move it till here lower to that and decrease the transparency because this transparency was not looking good so 75 will be the best and for this again bring it lower to this main image and you can make it to 75. So both the layers are done and your image is ready. So as you can see our image is ready and it is a good photo manipulation effect if you want to make a tutorial or if you want to make a poster out of it. So hope you like this tutorial and learn something out of it. So please subscribe to the channel for more beautiful tutorials like this. Thank you.